Which, that was actually completely... useless. Oh, that's not live wire. Abnormal shell. So here I'm using laser just to weaken things up for Vincent to kill. Ow. I remember that attack from way back in the day. Where that did like 100 damage and I cared about it. Now you have nothing! Except for a crushed skull! Oh, missed. You still have like MP left to do things like that? I will take it on! Holy crap, this guy has a lot! Most severe overkill. Especially because Vincent has no physical buffs at the moment. That's how powerful. Death Gigas is. <laughs> Just gotta make sure whatever you're attacking isn't immune to, ele immune to electric. But it's pretty cool, you get to walk by, see a few subs. Ah, what do I get? What do I get down to where I'm supposed to be? Huh, I don't remember this thing. Oh, it's awesome. I like it. Nothing to steal. What are you? Well, you have, N <laughs> you have MP. Guardian. 4,000 HP. Yeah. Fortunately, you're not going to live very long. Two more attacks, maybe? Wasn't really paying attention to the numbers, but if I'm a math nerd like I think I am, Oh yeah, I was right. <laughs> Love numbers. Love them. I, forget, I was just talking to somebody uh, at my work the other day, and they're like, "So, what do you do in your free time?" And I like, like was commenting on a, a video I was watching on the channel Vsauce, which is a great channel to like learn some interesting things. You're not getting wait, you're not getting the huge material just completely ran by the one guard. Oh no! We are surrounded. Whatever Oh wow, that actually did a lot of damage. It's okay, I might want to reconsider my my thoughts here. Alright, everybody attack somebody different. Yeah, that's an attack. Yeah, attack, attack Vincent. That's that's a fantastic idea. It's a trap. <laughs> Can you imagine like you're shooting a guy and then he turns into a death gigas? And then just strong arms you. You no give cookies! Gargantuck! I meant to say goodies, but it came out as cookies. I guess I was thinking about picking Yeah, I should probably be asleep right now. Yeah, right now I'm actually recording. It's 7.31 a.m. I've been awake since noon yesterday. Probably not my... So you were after the huge materia. Well, we really weren't. It was just kind of to, like, you know, foil whatever you guys were doing. Ooh, look at these guys. They're like black op versions of the Shinra Force. I wonder how fast they die. They die just as fast. <laughs> Little anticlimactic that we're breaking into Junon headquarters. And all their guards are armed with, like, bear guns. Although, I guess maybe if we weren't as grinded or, you know, what... The huge materia.
barely see it from all the fumes. Well, we know where it's at. That's what you think, goddamn motherfuckers! <laughs> we were a little late. I, I, I love Vincent. Vincent is definitely one of my favorite characters in this game, just because I love his terminology, just his expressions of it. Although, of course, you know, Sid is hysterical. Sid's a good time. Oh, that's right, Cloud no longer has the, uh... Long range on. Oh well, if I remember correctly, this guy only has 4,000 HP. And that means he's dead. <laughs> I was like, uh, you should be dead this next round. Oh, crit. Yay! Let's do this. Did we make it? There's a huge materia. It's a little tiny glass jar. Which is getting lowered into the sub. Like this huge materia, quote unquote, that could easily be carried by a single individual. Being lowered in a little glass container into a giant freaking submarine. Actually, I don't know if that's giant. I just assume it's giant. What are you doing? Help look. Um, yeah, it's us. The cloud. I refuse! I <laughs> love Vincent. You know I don't work for cheap! Either way. Or, either give it to us or else. Which is it gonna be? That's kind of like badass lately. Unfortunately, I don't have time to deal with you. What the heck is that thing? My priority is the huge material. And he just runs? So he's six... A random crane on us? A crane. Really? Hey, we're fighting a crane. We're fighting a crane. Oh, carry armor. I'm sorry. Its name is Carry Armor. My name is Neo Bahama. Have fun with that. We can get lightning. Grease lightning. So what else is we can get is, is Neo Bahama. Although your Bahamas are like your ultimate summons. Non-elemental damage, they're dragons. I remember when I first got summons, I thought like you had to open up a battle with the summon. Like it was the only way you were doing like massive damage. And I'd always start off doing my my big damage because I wanted to see what you know the enemy does when it gets below 50% health. Since some boss AIs have you know different strategies to get to below like 50 or below 25% health. So I do like all my damage. Wait, that hit three things? Yes, guys, this thing has three different pieces to it. But because he's weak to electric, I'm just gonna keep hitting everything. Um, can we have Vincent back? Please? I'd really like it if you gave my Vincent back. Break. Well, I actually did considerable damage. Oh, I can't heal him either. You know, if Vincent ever gets a turn again, you're pretty doomed. And even weirder, Vincent still has his, um... I can't imagine this thing has a whole lot of health left. 
especially if we already broke off one of his arms. But even better is that for some reason summons don't aren't able to injure your party members. And if you've managed to survive this long, Vincent can transform into a lightning beast. Come on, Livewire. Come on, Livewire. <gasps> no way. Come on, finish it off. Finish it off. That'd be so great. Livewire. Oh, I'm so disappointed. Lapis laser. Shelf. Hey, you still have 1900, holy crap. You got dog. And you're gonna survive. Just have your white wind on standby in case this kicking dunk misses. Dragon Knight! Yeah! Frickin' Vincent owns. I have so many friends who tell me they do not like Vincent. Whoa, time was born, MP and HP pluses, and we get God's Hand, which is actually a glove for Tifa, I believe? Taife? The person who I slept with and no longer uses. Ah! Damn, the submarine! There's one way. Hold on to your horses! Let's get it from them! Uh, 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 shit! They broke our crate and now they're coming for us. <laughs> Love this game. Alright, um, what do we got down here? Yeah, God's Hand is an item for Tifa. But again, she's no longer with us. Um, why did I even come back in here? Whatever. Um, was it material? Did I want to switch material? That's, that's kind of fun as it is. New Bahama and Alexander, I like it. I guess his arms only have like 10,000 health each, probably not a whole lot. Ooh, I like chest. Skimitar! I believe the uh, Skimitar in this is actually for Received Key Item Leviathan Scales. That's actually going to be a big thing. And it's funny because I was actually thinking about doing that side quest today. And it was super convenient that that just happened. So the Shkretar is for Sid, and you get triple growth, as well as a huge damage bonus. Um, what do you currently have in terms of this area? You destruct an added effect, that's about to level up. That just leveled up. And enemy skills. So, let's prepare you for your new weapon, Sid. We're gonna put counterattack and long range up there so that those level up fast. That's about to disappear. Enemy skill, I want to keep on you. And we'll give you. That. That. Enemy skill and comet. Yeah, that's a good one. Man, I need this equipped for like one battle. There we go. And where was Barrier? Did that level up? I still got 13,000 to go. Why did I unequip it? Ah, because it's making room for that. Um. Maybe Barrier instead. And sense. Ah, but now that bothers me. Stop looking all different colors than everything else. And what was I giving him? Skimitar. For triple growth. Love it. So that counterattack is now he's basically gonna counterattack every time. More or less. You know what? I should have really given him material like a material that I don't plan on ever using. Like heal. That way he still has my summons my comet. But 
but this is pretty awesome. Y you you have to fight your way on the submarine. These guys try to stop you like one at a time. <laughs> it's adorable. Can I steal from you before a dragon dive to you? No, no sympathy. Uh oh, Sid's calling it out. Oh no, here he goes! Ow! Ah! <laughs> Actually, the problem is that when I'm when I'm making those noises, it's completely out of sync from what you guys are watching. But yep, that's Dragon Dive. Pretty epic, if you ask me. Exit was born. And Mater Materia keeps leveling up at the weirdest times. There, there was enough for, uh... Oh my gosh, I can't even talk. Alright, so what went off set sense? I'm actually leveling up senses, that's hysterical. I didn't know what else to do! You're not taking over the ship! <laughs> That's what you think! This is my ship. Boom, baby. Boom, baby. Ooh, you're in the crit. Yeah, it's weird that uh, that Vincent is bogged down with so much material. Ooh, a shitter beta. Oh, and I'm on auto control, so I can't do anything. I think a shitter, shitter beta and alpha are both... You want the sub to just try to take it. Um, sir, maybe, maybe we should piss them off. Hey. So we have one guy gun point pointing a gun at us inside of a submarine. <laughs> and that just ends his life. But yeah, now Sid has triple AP growth, and I believe he's actually the only person. I think him and Actually, no, that's not true. Cloud also gets a triple AP growth. But yeah, if you don't like Sid, but you like your spellcasters, or you like that triple AP growth, just be warned that, uh, he is one of your few characters that has the most, like, no, no, this is terrible. We don't have much time left. I don't want to die. There's still so much more I've got to do. I never even got to do my special victory dance in battle. Alright, then make this your first victory! Go on and show them! Yes, sir! And where your last training? Begin! Yes, sir! It's our buddies that we used to uh, march in line with. I'm back, and now I got no regrets. Attack! Um... There's Shinra fighting. You know what? If I had just saved out there, I would let these three kill me. <laughs> well. Let's show them how it's done! Yarrgh! I'll treat them like real enemies. Especially because you get the shiver music playing. A special pose. Captain, I can't hold on any longer. Ugh, they, they got me. I believe if you take them prisoner, I think they say like one funny thing. But they are Shinra, and I'd rather have them be dead. Prisoners can be crafty things. Is it so someone, please? I I I'm sorry, I can't take it anymore. The, the lack of space, the, the shaking, the door of the engine. D Damn, Sam! I've got to get back in the air! And Vincent tries pressing buttons. I'm not very mechanical, but it's, 
Seems like we've starting to move. Hang in there. H hey, you're right. I, I, I do feel a little better driving. No sweat. Just leave everything to me. I'll be watching from here. Shinra's technology really is something. Well, now what? Let's read the manual. Submarine operation manual. Submarine. What did, did I say? Submarine. Jesus Christ! I'm tired. Beginner's edition. Button placements. Press up to descend. Left for left rotation. Right for right to, uh, rotation and down to ascend. Triangle to speed up. All right. So I want to mash square. Okay, that's all I need to know. Smash square. Mission orders. Presently on the ocean floor near Junon, a red leader submarine carrying huge material is being escorted by covert Shinra submarine units. Furthermore, it has been confirmed that several top mines have been dispersed onto the ocean floor. The ocean floor can only be monitored with Shinra's sonar radar screen. Enemy subs can only be detected within Sonar's area. Get in front of the detective enemy subs and lock on. Press square button to fire a torpedo. The mine. Why did I say square button? Why did it. The mines are found on the radar screen at the top of the indicators. The mines inflict great damage, so be careful. Objective sync the red leader carrying the huge material. Time limit is 10 minutes. Advice number one. Get the enemy submarine in front of you. Number two, concentrate attack on the red leader submarine. Three, if you lose track of the enemy, press the R1 button and use your radar. Word, I got it. Let's do this. Seat the seats! Everything seems set. Let's start the mission. This switch. Main screen on. Change the screen mode. <sighs> You're in the middle of a let's play. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, that was fun. I'm used to having to chase that thing, like, everywhere. Man, I've gotten so old. 16 seconds, and like 7 of those seconds were me messing around trying to learn what the controls did. <laughs> Received Shinra sub! We <laughs> Phew, we did it. The huge material should be at the bottom of the sea by now. Let's continue the search. All Shinra submarine units do you read? All Shinra submarine units do you read? Hmm, must be from Shinra. Report number 2. Make him shut up, just answer something. Alright, I'll do it. This is some Shinra number two, everything's normal. Roger. Your next mission is return to June on dock. We will transport the huge material from the airport. This without other assignments will report for guard duty. That is all. Over and out. June on airport? We should make it if we hurry. Forget about the huge material for now. We're climbing. First the ocean, now the air. What a busy day. I love his... Oh, he's so intelligent. Or, I think he's so intelligent. I love it. So, guys, now we re acquired a Shinra submarine. So now we can go underwater whenever we please and now traverse great du bl uh, blue deeps. But, however, we can only park it at base like this one, which those are actually kind of few and far between. Now, I'm actually a little bit confused, because I thought... Well, I've actually been recording for a little bit. Guys, I will see you in another episode. Thank you for watching, and ta-ta.